Tennis player Roger Crawford once said, quote, being challenged in life is inevitable. Being defeated is optional. And for one local football player, he's stiff arming those challenges and well on his road to victory. October 14th, 2022 is a date Aaron Unfried will never forget. The Del Oro High School star receiver was playing in a league showdown between his Golden Eagles and the Folsom Bulldogs. And in the blink of an eye, everything changed. I ended up tackling him, his cleat went like directly on my stomach and it knocked the wind out of me. Aaron initially thought nothing of it and tried to tough it out, but as days went by, he knew something wasn't right. It was like this crazy sharp pain, the worst like I've ever felt, you know, I could barely breathe. Several days after the incident, he received the diagnosis that would shake his world. They did a couple scans and they were like, your pancreas is grade five totally, fully torn in half and you have a nine inch cyst that is holding everything and saving your life. What ensued were multiple surgeries and he spent over 30 days in the hospital. My coaches came in to visit me in the hospital and a lot of tears were you know, shed during that period of time. Then Aaron received the good news he was waiting for. His doctors 100% cleared him to play on the next level, and now his road to recovery is in full effect. Since then, I've been going to the gym, you know, every day. I've been training in here for like the last month. Aaron hopes to walk onto the Boise State football team in the fall. I want to play college football. That's always a goal, a dream that I've had. Um, and so, you know, having this really major setback kind of puts me in a mindset to where like, okay, it's go time. Like this is a test, it's a challenge. Like you, I, I wanna prove to myself that I can do it. And I feel like that's one of the biggest aspects, um, you know, of motivation for me. When Aaron is not training, he dedicates his time to serving at his church and even leads mission trips to Mexico. He hopes to one day become a firefighter and coach football at Del Oro.